Title, Wild West at the Corner Store, Texas Teens Transform 7-Eleven into a Boxing Ring Over Cigars. T-L-D-R. A gang of five, comprising two adults and three minors, staged a boxing match at a Texas 7-Eleven after the staff denied a minor a cigar. Sounds like a scene from a bad movie, right? The entire drama, captured on video, included a countertop leap, a hefty punch or two, and a grand finale of miscellaneous objects being chucked at the employees. All right, buckle up folks. Remember when the biggest concern about convenience stores was whether they'd have your favorite chips in stock? Yeah, those were the days. Now, in the Lone Star State, they've evolved into makeshift wrestling arenas, olive skin. On June 3rd, the 7-Eleven on Faith and P. Lucas Boulevard became a setting for an impromptu throwdown after the clerk took a stand against youth smoking. A minor asked for a cigar, and like any responsible adult, the clerk said, nah, kiddo. Should have been the end of it, right? Well, the underage customer didn't take kindly to the refusal, and the next thing you know, she's back with a posse of four more troublemakers. The 7-Eleven CCTV footage became a goldmine of evidentiary wildness, as some of these would-be combatants were seen taking a leap over the counter, engaging in some hand-to-hand -hand action with the clerks, and flinging objects like they were auditioning for a role in a Michael Bay film. The authorities identified the adult members of the not-so-fantastic five as 19-year-old Alia Turner from Garland and 21-year-old Kiara Beale from Dallas. Turner is now dealing with warrants from another agency, and Bill has been charged with assault causing bodily injury. The juvenile members of the team got a hefty bonus of two counts of assault, criminal mischief, and theft. Now, the clerks may have had a rough day, sustaining facial injuries from this unscripted battle, but, thank goodness, they didn't need to be hospitalized. I've got to ask, has the world gone mad or what? Isn't it time we shifted from going viral to going kind? Why does a refusal to sell tobacco products to a minor turn into a royal rumble at a convenience store? And here's a thought for you, if a 7-Eleven can transform into a boxing ring over a denied cigar sale, what's next? Will the local library become a demolition derby because someone's favorite book is checked out? Disclaimer, this article does not promote or endorse any form of violence or illegal activity. All information is factual, as provided in the original news story. This is not advice, it's news. So, what's your take? Is society's sanity slipping faster than a kid on a water slide, or is this just a one-off event that's been blown out of proportion? And how can we address such an incident to prevent future occurrences?